to find the best audio interface requires a bit of searching around. But without one, we cannot link our instruments to the computer for recording, so they are definitely a necessity. Today there are plenty around, but that was not the case in the early days. They weren't needed. We have had computers for some time now, but in the early days, no one gave much thought to sound. There are many products available to choose from best audio interface, each with different characteristics benefits and prices. To help you make a perfect decision I did deep research, read tons of reviews, and compiled a list of the best audio interface from reputable brands. After much research, I found these products much helpful for people like you. If you want to know about the price and other information, be sure to check my description. So without any further delay let's jump into the video. Number 1. The Cuzrite Scarlet Audio Interface Bundle. This is a good place to start our search, as we know quite a bit about these. There is a lot that goes into making a good interface. AD and DA converters, filters, and preamps will produce a good or weak sound. It is, therefore, best to look at companies that have a long established track record. The Cuzright has such a record with experience going back to the mid-1980s, including creating one of the legendary all-time preamps, the ISA. The Scarlett 214 from Focusrite has two XLR TRS inputs, both will accept either microphone or instruments, and four outputs. Built in are two of Focusrite's preamps offering phantom power. There are also 10 decibels pads. It is USB powered and has a tough metal chassis and casing. On the front of the unit is a monitor volume and two gain controls, one for each input. There are push buttons for phantom power and stereo and mono selection. The 1 4th jack socket for headphones is also conveniently placed on the front with a headphone gain control. Are the MIDI out and in for connecting synthesizers and other MIDI modules and 4 RCA outputs. Balance outputs are provided for studio monitor connection with 1-4 sockets. You can also monitor the sound directly to avoid any potential latency. The gain control knobs have colored halos to give you information on input levels. This is a very impressive interface from an impressive manufacturer. Yes, it is basic, and some may want more features. But, it is a simple to use piece of kit, and for the money, it must be considered as one of the best value audio interfaces currently available. It has a tough build, so it will also serve you well away from your home studio, if you fancy doing some location recording. Simple to operate design with good features. Produces great results at an affordable cost. Number 2. Tascam USB Audio MIDI Interface. We move on to Tascam, who knows a thing or two about audio and recording. This is a compact little unit measuring just 8.5 inches by 12.4 by 4.1 inches. Very much a cheaper range model. It is packed with good features and might be considered the best affordable audio interface. It is a 2 and 2 out interface that features powerful mic and line preamps, giving up to 57 decibels gain. This provided a minimum of distortion and unwanted noise. It is built-in drivers to allow operation with OS and iOS computers and devices. It also has ACO Windows compatibility. Drum machines and synthesizers can be connected directly via MIDI and outs. The analog inputs are either XLR or TS, that accept line signals and balance microphones. You have a choice of two DAW application software options included for free, Ableton Lite 9 or Cakewalk Sonar X3, but you can obviously use it with any DAW of your choice. On the front panel, it has controls for phantom power, so you can use your condenser microphones. There are also gain controls for both channels and switches for micro line input. There is also a jack socket for a headphone connection for monitoring with separate volume control. Recording features are well thought out. For example, you can use both inputs at the same time, and these can be recorded as two separate mono tracks or one stereo track. For what is essentially a budget range interface, it does an excellent job at a great price point. This makes it an excellent choice for a starter interface for a new home studio. It does lack some higher level features, but for the price is good value. Easy to use, well built, and compact unit. Nice sounds with some good features at an affordable price. Number 3. Focusrite Claire 2. Back we go to Focusrite for another outstanding audio interface produced at a very affordable price. And another contender for the best high quality audio interface. This Claret model has 10 inputs and 4 outputs, and 2 of Focusrite's quality low noise preamps. Back we go to Focusrite for another outstanding audio interface produced at a very affordable price. And another contender for the best high quality audio interface. This Claret model has 10 inputs and 4 outputs, and 2 of Focusrite's quality low noise preamps. These can be used for microphones, guitars, bass, keyboards, or just anything else, really. Each channel has a gain control and controls for 48V phantom power, which allows you to use your condenser mix if you wish. The dials have halo lighting to make setting levels easier. The Claret offers the air option, which recreates a model of a 30-year-old analog transformer. It combines with the modern preamp for a unique sound. Also located on the front of the unit is a headphone socket with volume control. One of the critical areas to get a great sound is the analog conversion to digital audio. 
The Claret has 24-bit 192 kHz conversion rates, which are impressive. The sound going into your DAW is therefore clean, if you want it to be, that is. It also features a low disk number 4. Axe Channel Audio Interface. The Axe is a two-channel audio interface for MIC Multimedia. It was founded in Italy in 1998 and has developed a wide range of products for the audio and digital recording world. One of their better known products is the IRG, an interface for connecting a guitar to a computer. The Axe is a 2 in 5 out compact interface, measuring 9.3 inches by 2 by 7.8 inches. It features two Class A preamps with plus 48V phantom power for your condenser microphones. While its 24 bit 192 kHz performance is an ideal quality level. If you are using guitar or bass, there is an active or passive selector for the type of pickup you are using. There is also an impedance control, as well as a built in tuner. One of the big assets this interface has over many of its contemporaries is the extras that are built in. Ableton Live Lite is included, but so is Amplitude 4 Deluxe. Now, this is worth having a look at. It includes a wealth of extras, including well over 140 different guitars and bass guitar models. Cabinets, amps, speakers, and various microphones are also included. As well as 15 rack effects and 33 stompbox options. It is a very impressive array of functions. Getting through all the options available is going to take some time. Most things you will ever need are included within this little box. As with most units like this, the effects and options are quite basic. Don't go expecting high-level studio quality reverbs, delays, and ek, but they are more than adequate. With all these excellent features, we would place this unit at the top end of the starter studio market. Plenty of options, good performance, and at a reasonable price point, it ticks most of the boxes for a new studio development. Just allow yourself a bit of time to learn how to use it. Packed with features, options, and additional software. Lots of variables for sound modeling at an affordable price. Number 5. RME Audio Interface. With RME's Fireface Audio Interface, we move up a gear. This is a step up from the kind of interface you might consider if you are setting up at home. Its impressive connectivity options mean it will cope with just about anything you require. It has the capacity to be able to handle 60 channels, 30 in and 30 out. These include 12 analog, a DAT on 16 channels, and A's on 2. You will get an input level of plus 18 decibels and 75 decibels of gain from 4 microphone circuits. Importantly, powerful headphone outputs to ensure you have enough volume for quality monitoring. The analog presence in this interface is impressive, and it uses high-quality ADD8 converters to deliver clear and defined audio. The controls located on the front of the interface include four combi inputs and a MIDI in-out. Also, a clear color screen for monitoring performance. Placed on the front is a direct port that gives you playback and direct recording to an external drive. This is really an asset in so many ways that we haven't got the space here to itemize all of its many functions. A brief sample though is that it offers ACK, reverb delay, and dynamics control. Access to- that's all from my end. I make helpful videos daily so do subscribe my channel. If you need more information or if you want to know product price do check out my description. For any kind of problem please comment below. Stay updated with our cool products as it will make your life much more easier.